Hello and welcome to this brief tutorial video on how to migrate an InTouch legacy application into the latest version uh, at the time of this recording of Aviva InTouch 20, version 2020. Okay, first we'll begin by opening up Application Manager. And we're just simply going to go up to Tools, Find Applications, and we're going to navigate to where we got our uh, applications stored. I just so happen to have them under Demo, uh, or I'm sorry, Legacy InTouch Applications, and go ahead and select. And it has found my demo applications. And let's take a look at the versions. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to migrate a 9.5 application and a 7.1 application. So let's start with the 7.1. So I'll right click on it. You'll notice that I can only select Window Maker. So I'll select Window Maker and just simply go through the motions. Well, it just asks me the question, do I want to back up the application before migration? Uh, it's always generally a good idea to back it up. <laughs> and uh, so if you don't have a backup already and I'm going to convert the resolution from 800 by 600 to 1920 by 1080 so let's go with that so um, as you can see that was rather quick um, obviously it will uh, uh, take some time if de depending on the, the type of application you have and the number of windows uh, but this one was very very quick so I'll just uh, give me a little security notice this is something new with uh, Viva 2020 it just says that this InTouch application is configured to use InTouch security we strongly recommend you use OS based security instead okay and so just an informational message alright and that should be good to go I'll just simply exit out We'll go. We'll deal with runtime later. We'll go back to InTouch Application Manager, and we will do the other one as uh, as well. Let's see here. Now, as you can see, that one has been converted up to 2020. Now, let's go to 9.5. And just like with the other one, we're going to, you know, go with the defaults. It's always good to have an, uh, a backup. Now, as far as converting the resolution, you may, depending on the type of application you have, you may want to uncheck that. Uh, again, this is could be a gotcha here, especially if you're, you know, using very old graphics. So in this case, I'm just simply going to uncheck it and just say, OK. It'll open up Window Maker. and it converted really really quick so I'll just say OK and we get the same informational message and I'm just gonna check this box so I don't have to see it again and we'll just simply exit out and we'll open up application manager again to check our applications as you can see they're all set for version 20 and let's go down here to this original app and we'll go to window viewer this was the original 7.1 application and we have a legacy application uh, that we want to run that's the test prot and we have our uh, legacy reactor demo so we'll exit out of this and let's check the 9.5 this was the original 9.5 and as you can see the old uh, reliable uh, reactor demo comes up. Okay, that concludes this brief tutorial video on how to migrate a legacy InTouch application into Aviva InTouch version 2020. Thanks for watching.